I, I don't think that it's because that person's evil because they are trying to like, I've seen it. I've seen people do this. When you see fraud, like you see, you, I mean, you, could t- you, you know this, when you actually see real fraud, like shingles torn off or like fake hail, yeah. you're like, oh, this is so obvious. It's so obvious. People, when people try to fake stuff or they try to be bad, they're easy to catch. Oh, right? I love those. Yeah. I, I took a training class recently. I think it was, um, I want to say it was all cat. I went to one of their seminars recently for their certification and man, they just like, when you see it on a diagram where the hits are, it's always in an area that it's just easier to access. Right. You're sometimes really near the eve and they're, I think it's, it's a human nature to find patterns to go oh, ahead yeah. and sit there. One, two, one, two two one two it's yep. it becomes easier to catch and yeah i mean these people don't know what they're doing they're not us they don't no. take classes to how to how to not commit fraud and how to commit fraud it's we're seeing it and we know what yeah. to do it's just some dude you know looking at his 1300 dollars a month truck payment and all his bills and everything thinking all right i need to sell more roads how am i going to get these you know and then he just gets the bright idea the bad idea fairy sitting on his shoulder saying hey you should you know Take a quarter, or, you know. Yeah. Take, so take some hammer. ice cubes. Let's take, take, a, ice cube. take a sock full of ice cubes and just pound on my roof. I they have they have a uh, not only is there an intent, but there's a benefit, and that's what we see. Yeah, yeah. What do they so, have to gain? Long story short, you know, and you have homeowners that'll that'll say, you know, like, well, I'm just, you know, this really happened. You know, they don't they don't want to be accused of doing fraud. I'm like, sure. Listen, I know this. Gets, everybody that I've looked out on your streets getting a new roof—it's the hail hit. There's, I mean, you can't fake that hole in your siding that's 26 feet up on the. <laughs> yeah, like so I'm like, just try. relax. <laughs> We're not. I'm not, I'm not the police. I'm not here to like. Yeah, I, I think we get a bad rap. A lot of yeah. people think that we're there to deny claims. That we make money based oh, on denying claims. I mean, I'm not a staff adjuster. I can't say that that's what we do. But as an I IA, I'm there to make money. Yeah. I'm there to write as much as I can that's reasonable and not hyperinflated. I'm there to get you what is owed. Yeah. I'm a fiduciary agent. I'm looking at things in an unbiased lens, and I'm trying to maximize the payment to you because it is owed to you. It's yeah. not with any malice or, or, or evil intent. I truly want you to be back the way you were prior yeah. to the storm. Yep, exactly. If you're a brand new adjuster working for a major IA firm, you will most likely already be covered under a blanket errors and emissions policy. You probably already pay something like five or $10 per claim for this coverage. And what is errors and emissions? Well, if you're accused of messing something up on a claim, your E and O insurance will step in and help you out. But what if you cause damage or injury on a field inspection? For example, your ladder falls down and smashes the insured's brand new Ford F-150 Lightning. Then a general liability policy will cover you in that instance. Again, you likely have a little bit of protection to your IA firm as a newbie adjuster. However, if you've got a year or two under your belt and you make most or all of your annual income from claims work, then you owe it to yourself to upgrade your e and general liability coverages to be customized to you. And depending on how many claims you run in a year, there's a very good chance these policies will be cheaper for you with your own coverages. Better and cheaper? Sign me up. There's only one company that provides e and and general liability solely to the insurance industry, and that is CPLIC, aka Kaplik. They even have drone and cyber coverages. Download the free guide all about the different kinds of insurance you as the adjuster should carry at cplic.net slash adjuster TV. And with more than 700 videos, there's plenty more to watch here on Adjuster TV. Don't know where to start? Just go to my videos page here on YouTube and type in a search term right here to find an answer to almost any question you have about property claims handling. And we'll see you in the next one.